questions. This first one is by uh, W.B. Yates. Education is not the filling of a pail, but the lighting of a fire. Second quote from James Joyce's Ulysses. Hold to the now, the here through which all future plunges to the past. Prelude, Sunset in America, 1100 CE. This first poem is titled Cahokia. Sky of fire, vermilion streaked lilac. Cloaked in 20,000 small shells, his eyes span the panorama before him. Thatched huts inside the wood palisade, two miles long. Thousands more outside Cahokia's ceremonial center. Atop this grandest of grand plazas, 41 football fields in size. He eyes the portion where they'll play chunky in tomorrow's day, tossing spears exceeding his size toward a stone. He'll watch as thousands cheer. From heart to hip, his hand traverses shells, thinks upon several hundred sunrises of travel up and down the river, acquiring them. He wonders on what he's never seen, the vast river emptying to ever larger water, strangely garbed tribes to the far south. From the top of the pyramid, atop the plaza, 100 feet higher than the thatched huts, he is solid enough, secure enough to dream. Peering into color streaked sky, he can't imagine the spot of sky he eyes a few miles away, someday will be the St. Louis Arch. Cahokia. Center of the world, home to 15,000. Shells clatter as he outstretches arms, absorbs the setting sun, looks to the south and wonders what his world will be. 150,000 sunsets from now. 